Okay, in this process here, we've got an entire process without any videos attached, and we want to start attaching videos to each of the operations in turn. Uh, the way to do that is to take a video of the operation, let's say the prepare cage operation here, and analyze it as we've described throughout the video time study module area here. So you can see I've got all the different activities involved in preparing the cage here for the, uh, for the process. Okay, so what we want to do is take the results of this and make it available back over here in our video time study to associate it with the different activities you have right here. So let me show you how you do that. It's very straightforward. Um, so what we're going to do is, first of all, back in our video area here, we're going to save the study. So we do a save as. And I'm just going to save it as one I've already got here, obviously. And now we've got it saved in there. And then we can leave it open or close. It doesn't make any difference. Over here, what we do is we uh, come down here and we point to each activity in turn. So here's walk the cage, we hit the right button. And we can say edit media here, edit media. And then it brings up the edit media options, which are discussed, these options are discussed in a separate video. We go to the file area here, and we say times from VTS, and we're going to locate that particular one that we're looking for here. So it's in my Timer Pro videos area here. And I'm going to open up the teardown one. And it presents me with a screen here. Here are all the observations we made along with the times here. So the first op option we have is walk to the cage and grass. So I if it's several in here, I want to pick one that's representative of how long it should take. So I may take it here for this uh, this particular one here. And I can actually double click on it. It'll play it back to me here. And you'll see the guys walking here. And then all you do is says here, double click on the grid to set the video time data. So I double click on the walk to cage here. And it's going to put the value in here, and I save the changes. All right, so I can do that for one of them, or I can do it for them all, one after the other here. So I go to the next one here, I click on this, and I say Edit Media. I can use a recent VTS. It remembers the last one I used. I bring it up here. So Collapse Cage, I might say I want this one here. Double click that there. The Push to Compress, uh, I might pick one down here as representative. Double click here, uh, trolley into area. I've only got one of these down here. So here's a trolley into area. We highlight that, double click here. You see the times being associated with it. Load cage, double click here, and then cage aside, and double click here. So what we've done is we've basically loaded up all of the videos to do with this one particular operation here. And then we click on save changes, and you'll see it puts them all back in here individually here and from here we're ready to go on to the next process and continue to add it here. So again to summarize you click on the activity you wish to start with, you click on edit media, you select the file, the appropriate file for you to use, I'll just pick the one again here and then you start associating the observations you made in your video time study with the observations in your uh, balance chart here.